Hello, this is Nick with Albert Air, and today we're going to be, we are going to be looking at the ADP 5 ton 120 volt Moduflex E furnace, which is basically a fan coil uh, that we just installed. I'm going to go through this installation, show you what we did, and discuss some of the features and benefits of the system. As always, please like this video and subscribe to our channel for more content about fan coils and heat pump systems. Uh, if you have any questions, please leave a comment in the section below and I'll be sure to answer those for you. And if you're in the Orange County, California area and like to talk more about these products or any other types of systems, uh, please give me a call at 714-526-6368. So let's get right into this. Uh, so we're looking at that new ADP. Uh, 120 volt Moduflex E furnace fan coil. This is a direct replacement for a gas furnace to go to an all electric heat pump system. Uh, before we installed this, um, there the customer had an older gas furnace. The customer wanted to go with an all electric heat pump system and after many considerations, uh, we decided to go with this particular uh, e-furnace because it's 120 volts, therefore it would be able to be plugged back into the same outlet that the furnace was, uh, which makes it for an easy installation. We do not have to run a new 240 volt circuit to uh, the closet where this is located, so it reduces the cost. Um, so this is five ton, so it is 21 inches width by only 30 inches high by 28 depth, which is very similar to what a five ton furnace is. So it does fit back in here, no problem. We also down here, we have a four inch media filter, which is a MERV 13 and that's by Honeywell. Um, and up here we do have an ADP five ton fan coil, which is rated to do a heat pump. Um, we also have our drain lines right here. Our primary drain line runs down and out. And then we have a secondary shutoff switch right there. We adapt to the plenum on top and we did run these new refrigerant lines down and out and under the house where we put the heat pump fan coil, which I do have another video about that. Uh, we used a carrier uh, compact heat pump fan coil, uh, sorry, um, uh, heat pump condenser with this fan coil and uh, we mounted it on the side of the house because it's on a hill So I will have another video on that. Definitely you want to check that out um, So again, just to go through what some of the basics are on this is it is 120 volt It has a five-speed ECM blower motor in it So it's very efficient and it will help qualify for some of those heat pump rebates out there um, depending on which ones you're, you're trying to qualify for. Uh, you'd have to check with the availability of the money for those rebates as well as is what exactly does need to be qualified. But a lot of them are just to change from a gas furnace over to an all electric system. So uh, this one would work for those types of rebates. Um, as far as efficiency, this will, this will be a standard efficient furnace. Um, so when it's matched with the, the heat pump condenser we have now, it is a 14.7 SEER 2 efficiency system, which is a very high efficiency compared to something that's say 10 to 20 or 30 years old. Um, some other things about this uh, that make it very nice is that all these cabinet sizes that they come in are gonna be like the furnace width. So 21 inches wide on the five ton. On the four ton, it would be 17 and a half inches wide. And then on the three ton, it comes in 17 and a half and 14 and a half inches wide. So that is the same dimensions as the furnaces in those sizes. So instead of the older uh, 240 volt fan coils, which we still have on the market, but I say older because eventually they'll all start changing over to something a little more compatible with changing a gas furnace for this. Um, those, those old fan coils are typically about 54 inches tall. So they would come up to here and they're square, 22 by 22 or 20 by 20. So sometimes the, uh, you can't get them into the space that you would like. You do have to do some modifications to the closet underneath it, different filter sizes, stuff like that. So, so all in all, this makes for a great system. Uh, the ease of installation was very nice. We obviously, the flu vent was up here, so we cap that. The gas line is right on the side, so we cap that, no longer needed. We have the electrical plugged into the same outlet, which made that very easy. So let me know what you think of this. If, is this something that you might be interested in? Is this something that might work for you if you'd like to go to an all electric system? I think it's great. I think everything worked out very nice with this system. Installation was easy. 
Um, so give us a call if you have any questions or visit us at www.albertair.com. Our phone number, if you're in the Orange County area, is 714-526-6368. Thank you for watching.